President Obama started this week by wrapping up a two-day trip to the Twin Cities, where he met with Rebecca, a working mom who sent him a letter about the struggles middle-class families like hers are facing in America. Well, don't take another picture. <laughs> After lunch, the president hosted a town hall meeting at Minnehaha Park in Minneapolis. The discussion focused on a wide range of issues, from health care to the economy, as the president highlighted progress in these issues, despite opposition from Republicans in Congress. Despite all that, some folks have health care that didn't have it before. Despite all that, some students are able to afford their education better. Despite all that, some folks have jobs that didn't have it. Despite all that, the Green Line got built here in Minnesota. Then it was on to Grand Avenue in St. Paul, where the president found some time to do a little shopping and visit with the locals. <laughs> and it's just great. It's a great snack. <laughs> Solid. Let's go this way. i got to go get some ice cream. OK. There's a good spot down there. My first job was scooping ice cream. My one first job that I actually, one that one of you might be present. <laughs> Outstanding. Friday, the president stopped by a local job training center to introduce himself. I'm Barack Obama. I'm, I'm the president <laughs> of the United States. He was there to speak to a group of young mothers taking part in classes to train for and find jobs, and shared why programs like Project Care are so important to him and to the rest of the country. I was basically raised by a single mom. My mom was 18 when she had me, so basically my mom was... Uh, in a similar place to a, a lot of you guys. Mm -hmm. And you know, she was able to get an education and you know, take advantage of grants and loans and programs to be able to make a difference in her life and ultimately her kids' lives. We're really trying to make sure that we give all of you some opportunities and some chances to thrive and, and do great things as well. What is it like being a president? The best days are the days where you feel as if you, you've helped somebody. Mm -hmm. And then the worst days are when you're not getting anything done, uh, even though you're, you've been really working hard at something. Are we holding here? Well, where, when do I get to see Rebecca's family? Smile and say cheese. Then it was on to the Lake Harriet Band Show, where the president met back up with Rebecca and her family before taking the stage to talk about the urgent need for Congress to focus on the economy. Despite the unyielding opposition, there are families who have health insurance now who didn't have it before. And there are students in college who couldn't afford it before and their workers on the job who didn't have jobs before, and their troops home with their families after serving tour after tour. Don't think that we're not making progress. Then it was back to Washington, D.C.